greetings everybody been a long time since I put down a new video but I've been having a few issues with um, my new Mac and although it is uh, brand new um, it still suffers from stupid problems um, related to peripherals and uh, this particular one um, was to do with the keyboard now I don't know if any of you have ever had a problem where you can't wake your machine up after it's gone to sleep um, but if so uh, I think I might have found one of the causes and I might have some options for you to um, try in case this particular option doesn't work okay what I discovered was that uh, when it went to sleep the keyboard nor the mouse would wake up the machine now previously my keyboard had said I've got low batteries so I replaced the batteries and presumed the world would be a happy place um, however not seeing that this is a coincidence uh, my machine started to go a bit pear-shaped so started to do some research um, and work and what we have here is uh, a way of turning off hibernation um, more or less in older machines but it should still work and the other thing is um, this latter part remove the system hibernation file uh, again these are all remedial things that you can try um, to see if they work they're not going to do any harm and they're all reversible uh, however in my case it was relatively straightforward um, what I did was um, I opened up my Bluetooth I found my keyboard and then got rid of it and so now um, I then put the keyboard into a search mode in which case it finds what you're looking for then you pair it and normally it's going to ask you for a code in which you enter on the keypad seven five four two three six and then enter and that's it um, and believe it or not all my um, hassles went away um, so there was just a, a conflict between the Bluetooth and the Bluetooth keyboard and it just basically needed resetting I did do a PRAM which on a Mac is pull out the power for a few minutes um, and then plug it back in again um, but that didn't seem to fix any problems um, however this did uh, so if if the keyboard thing is not going to help um, by removing the actual keyboard from your Bluetooth list and putting it back on again then maybe one of these um, options over here might help all right well um, if it's been of any good to you or any use to you um, I'm pleased and should you have any problems um, feel free to uh, contact me. Okay, thanks very much. Speak to you soon. Goodbye.